Rosie. What is it this time? Well, it's about these Amazonian weapons. You're right, Rosie. I'll give you some magical Amazonian items. How is this going to help me fight someone who has a gun? I present to you the lasso of truth. You asphyxiate the guy by squeezing it really tight, and he will tell you anything you want. Sometimes they even cry. Hmm. And this is all magic, right? Exactly. We can give you more Amazonian things, like these magic disarmament handcuffs. You lock it to the person's wrist, then lock it elsewhere, and that's it. He's disarmed and easily dominated. I think I get it. There's also the Hercules body-locking armor. Let me guess. It's made out of leather? Exactly. Magical dragon leather. You put this on your enemy with just a hole for the eyes and a zipper for his mouth. And if he keeps talking, you use this gag here at the magic ball of silence. Just tie the gag to his mouth and that's it. He'll be quiet. He'll just moan once in a while. Side effect of the magic. Look, magic is supposed to be something out of Harry Potter, not out of Fifty Shades of Grey. This isn't even magic. This is all just bizarre BDSM bullshit. Let me guess. The other weapons are the lit cigar of honesty to be put out on someone's back and the ball crushing high heels of humiliation. Clearly, you are not taking this seriously. These are real weapons forged for us by a... By a guy who licks your shoes and keep saying he was a really bad boy begging you to hit him with a paddle? Was that the guy who invented these magic things for us? You're right! This motherfucker will get his just desserts! I'll finish him off with a humiliation paddle and then I'll make him clean the floor with his tongue and then I'll choke him! Yes, of course. I think that'll teach him a lesson.